hey guys and welcome back to our channel vs codes so we are back with another long challenge of code chef april long challenge so we'll discuss the problem with the matrix that's from division 3 and 2 i guess in division 1 2 so uh before we begin make sure you subscribe to our channel uh, as we are about to reach 1k so please do it fast it's it looks good so let's begin with the discussion of the problem so here you can read she found a matrix a with n rows and m columns so you need to uh, enter the values it's an input n and m so where each r, row r and column c the cell is noted by r comma c okay you all know that this matrix has two interesting properties so basically uh, re apart from reading let me tell you directly so the properties are uh, that it would be non decreasing so each el uh, each element of each row and column would be equal or greater than the previous element uh, so basically what we have to do is we have to find k worthy sub matrix in of uh, in a or uh, a's are the big matrix and we have to find k worthy sub matrices matrices with l rows and l columns such that the average of all the integers in this sub matrix is greater than or equals to k so in simple words we have to find such small matrices in a big matrix so that the sum of integers of those small matrices each small matrix is greater than or equals to k so k is an input here uh, let's see the inputs so t test cases n m and k so n the k input is the k worthy sub matrix yeah, as you can see in the sample input uh, we have taken uh, they have take given one uh, test case so 3 3 so 3 by 3 matrix is the a matrix and 4 k worthy matrices so we have to find uh, we can uh, it's written here 7 4 worthy matrices okay so the output is 7 here so let's see how it came uh, so if we uh, if you take the uh, as a matrix if you take it and write it on a paper 2 2 and 3 4 so uh, taking the average it will come less than 4 so we'll not consider it next matrix 2 3 4 5 taking the average again it will be less than 4 so we'll not consider it next matrix 3 4 4 and 5 the average is 4 so and the matrix occurs only once so we'll consider it next matrix 4 5 5 5 uh, its average is 4.75 the matrix also occurs only once so we'll consider it next matrix we can take is uh, 4 so 4 the average is 4 and it occurs two times so we'll take 2 uh, Two, so total till now we got it 4 and then we'll take 5 5 and 5 with an average its average is 5 greater than 4 so we'll, we find it matters 3 times so like this the output becomes 7 so as you can see in subtask 1 and 2 uh, the sum of n into m over all test cases does not take, exceed 10 to the power 3 and 4 into 10 to power 5 i guess you uh, you all can easily score 40 points in it and for 60 points that the that is the original constraints you need to go through some tough coding so i hope you all solve this problem soon and if you want to read about the sub matter what is sub matrix so you can click on the link that's given in okay what the sub matrix click on it and you will get to know about uh, what is the sub matrix and how it is how it's formed so all the best and see you in the next qu uh, question explanation i guess the next problem that uh, 
right now the uh, Korchev servers are down exactly so hope so we'll get the next uh, you'll get the next video by tomorrow so keep coding and do subscribe to our channel and make sure you hit the like button thank you